I just want to read from the Word of God, Matthew chapter 6, verse 24, which says, No one can serve two masters, for either he will hate the one and love the other, or else he will be loyal to one and despise the other. You cannot serve God and mammon. Basically, this is saying, God is saying to us that, listen, guys, you can't serve God and mammon. You can't have two masters. You can't love the flesh and the spirit at the same time. You just can't love Jesus Christ and the way of the world at the same time. You have to either... Uh, be devoted to the world, fully devoted to the world, or you would despise Jesus. If you're fully devoted to the world, or if you're loyal to the world, you would despise the word of God. What we find today in, Christi in Christianity is that a lot of people are loyal to the world. They just like the world, they look like the world, they behave like the world, and then they have a form of godliness despising the word of God. What it is to be loyal? When you're loyal to someone, you respect that person, you're devoted to that person, you're dedicated to that person, you value such one, and you would serve that person with such dedication and love and respect. Is that what we do when we serve Jesus Christ? Do we value his word so much that we're defending what he says? Do we really respect his word to the letter that we want to please him? We want to serve him, not because someone tells us, but, but because we want to do it. Let us be loyal to our Lord. And of course, he deserved it. He deserved to be loyal to. And let us not be loyal to this world. Let us not be loyal to the devil. Can you imagine being loyal to the devil in a way that you may, you may not believe that you are loyal to him? But if you are not loyal to Jesus, and if you are not serving Jesus 100%, you are loyal to the devil and you are despising Jesus, you're loyal to mammon, you're loyal to the things of this world, and you're despising the very word of God. I want us to check ourselves this morning. Check ourselves and see where our loyalty is. Is it in your job? It is in your family? Is it in your children? Is it in your money? What? Where is your loyalty? You know the Bible said, where your heart is, there your treasure will be also. Is your treasure on this earth that you love so much money and you love the things of this world um, and, and your treasure is not in heaven? Let us make sure that our treasure is with Christ and we, our hope is in him and our loyalty is in him. I trust your loyalty will be in the Lord and not on things of this world. There are evidence that your loyalty would be whether in Christ or on the world. The evidence is this that your mind, your heart would be on the things that you are most loyal about. The first thing you would wake up in the morning and think about it. You would go to bed thinking about it. And because that's where your loyalty is and you want to serve it. If it's your job or whatever, I trust you, it doesn't worth being loyal to. Loyal, be loyal to the word of God. Don't be loyal to this world because this world is passing away and it is passing quickly. It's me again saying, well, good. God bless.